Welcome to our quick tour that will help you get started with Elementor. When you first enter Elementor, you'll see the content area displayed on the right. Here, you can view and edit the various elements on the page. On the left is the panel where you can choose from the different widgets and control their settings. Your first step is to add a new section. When adding a section, you can choose from 12 different column layouts. Let's go ahead and choose three columns. To resize the width of the columns, click on the side of the column and drag it left or right. Time to add some content to the page. Simply drag and drop one of the many widgets available on the panel. After dragging the widget to the page, the panel will automatically switch to show the widget settings. The first tab of this panel is called Content. Here, you can edit the content of the widget. The second tab is Style, where you can change styling attributes like alignment and text colors. The third tab is Advanced. This lets you control more advanced settings like margin and padding. By clicking on the Column button, you get the Settings panel for the column you've clicked on. You can add a new column by clicking on the Plus button. You can also click on the Duplicate button to duplicate the entire column, or delete it by clicking on the X button. You can also grab a column and move it to a different position within the section, or move it to a different section altogether. Sections are also movable. Grab one of the sections and drag it above or below other sections. Clicking on the Section button will open the Section Settings panel. Here you can use the Duplicate and Delete buttons in much the same way as shown with the column. To make sure your design is responsive, click on the Display button located at the bottom of the panel. From here, you can switch between desktop, tablet, and mobile views. Want to see how your page looks like? Press the arrow in the middle of the panel to hide the panel. Don't forget to press Save to save your work. I hope you've enjoyed this quick tour of Elementor. If you want to learn more, visit docs.elementor.com.